Here we have a rectangular prism. It has a length of 4, a width of 4, and a height of 8. Now if you think about it, a prism is really just a collection of six different planes. We have planes on the top and bottom, planes on the left and right, and planes on the front and back. We can use that information to find the surface area. The surface area will just be the area of each of those six planes added together. Luckily, we have an equation to find the surface area of a rectangular prism. It is surface area equals 2 times length times width plus length times height plus width times height. So, for this rectangular prism, the surface area is equal to 2 times 4 times 4 plus 4 times 8 plus 4 times 8, or simply 160 square inches.